Hey everybody, this is Joseph over at Synergy 17 and um, today I want to talk about um, a couple tools that I use to, you know, when I'm making things. Uh, this isn't garment decorated related, this is more of uh, awards and plaques. And um, something uh, a friend of mine asked me to do was to make her um, a little uh, plaque piece that's going to go on, um, it could go on a trophy, it can go on anything really. And this one here was done purely with um, Romark material. It's plastic, so I just simply laser cut uh, the design out and uh, engraved it that way, and laser engraved it. So this one was pretty simple. I didn't need any special tools besides my laser. Um, this other one I did in metal. So the one in metal, I couldn't cut it. I can laser engrave it, but I can't actually cut these shapes out. So I used a few um, other tools to help me do this, and I'll show you what these are. So most people are familiar with different um, cutting type devices. There's some that just have a straight down, um, like a kind of like this. It's kind of like this one, but it's not. This is more of a guillotine style. The other one, I can't even think of the name. It's more of a chop style. But what happens is when you do the chop style one, it starts to curl. It starts to curl the metal. So that's why I went with the guillotine style. Um, they're not really cheap. They're pretty expensive. But these are one of the better ones that I've used before. And you have this angle here that helps cut it. And in the back here, it's a little stop and then it's got a ruler here. So I kind of just put my metal as far as I need it to go out and then I'll just cut a small piece off on this piece right here. And it's just pretty simple, you know, it cuts this piece off here and I got a little scrap back here um, that I don't need. But it's super sharp, works really well. I've cut through all kinds of materials and metals and plastics on it and it's a great uh, machine. It's worth it. I mean, it's a few hundred bucks, but um, it's, it's well worth it if you do this type of stuff all the time. Now to get um, the different edges here, you could have them um, scalloped or you could have them rounded. I use another little tool and I'll show you that one. This is another tool that I use. I, I can't remember the name of the place I got it from. I think it was called uh, tr Main Trophy Supply or something. But it's a simple tool that does um, another good job for me or helps me out a lot. And that's if I want to um, put uh, like a a scallop or I want to punch a hole kind of like these ones here. Um, you don't have to do the scallop, you can just you could also round edges. So the way it works is uh, there's some a couple settings you just basically slide this metal piece out to decide what you want to do and uh, there's a couple little uh, settings on the side or mechanical settings over here. So let's say for example on this piece right here take this off. Let's say I just want to put a corner in here. So I'm going to mount this. The way I have it set right now I could put this in here flip this all the way over and it simply punches a hole in the corner so that way if I'm going to mount it with a small screw um, I could do that. Now let's say I wanted to uh, round the edges. Up top here there's a little piece, I don't know if you see it right here, um, it allows you to put the top corner inside of it here and flip it back and what that does is that rounds the edge so we have a nice round edge. Um, the last thing I mean, that I kind of like to do is I make this adjustment here, slide this in more, and this decides how much of a, a scallop I want. And then I set this to, if I want to do a scallop only, I can put this in here. And it, see, it basically, I said these mechanical things basically stop certain things from happening. So if I just want a scallop in it, I do that, and I have one here. Um, if I want one with the hole, I make this little change here. And it allows me to allows the handle to make the scallop and then go all the way through like this. So it's just a handy tool to have. Um, these two things work really well together.